Zendikupo, fresh off a 24-point game and a win over the Los Angeles Clippers on Friday. Saturday, the Bucks hosting the Toronto Raptors. One of their new additions, Serge Ibaka, had 19 in the ballgame. Toronto on top, 11-2 early on. And the Bucks, uh, they started this game a little bit late. As in 2 of 18 from the floor to start the ball game, including 0 of 8 from downtown. Two air balls like you just saw right there. And then Greg Monroe missing a wide open bunny. A season low 12 points in the first quarter for Milwaukee. They'd get it together though in the second. Malcolm Brogdon on the drive using the left hand for the finger roll. He had 17 in the ball game. Then Matthew Delavadova kicking out to Spencer Hawes for a three ball. Milwaukee regaining a lead and building it 37 30. Giannis Antetokounmpo look at him spin baseline and show off the athleticism. The flush is good. Then off the inbounds, Giannis finding Spencer Hawes, and why not? Let the good times roll. Hawes with a circus shot, had 14 in the first half. Bucks led by 11 at halftime. DeMar DeRozan on the drive, gets the lay-in, but Damari Carroll steps on Tony Snell's foot, rolls his ankle. He would lead the game a left ankle sprain. Carroll would not return. Bucks taking advantage. Middleton, Chris Middleton. Stealing DeMar DeRozan's pass, going coast to coast for the lane as Middleton starting once again for Milwaukee, keeping his minutes above 30 for the third straight game. And then the Greek Freak spinning baseline again, 21 and 10 for him. Norman Powell stepping up in the absence of Kyle Lowry, once again out after wrist surgery, cutting the Bucks' lead to six. Then Monroe gets it inside to Middleton. A season high 24 for him as the Bucks win by seven at home.